I'm going to run uh, a chess program Houdini 2.0C Pro X64 on 12 threads overclocked. Uh, you can see right there the clock is running. 1337 minutes, shredder interface. I don't know what's causing those lines. I can't get those lines out of my video, so I'll just have to work on that. So here's the position. Alicon versus Cablanca. I didn't pronounce that right. That's the position. And Tudini 2.0 C Pro. 4096 hash setting. It's on depth 42. Clock is still running. 1338 minutes. 46,000 K notes a second. Now let me show you the overclock. Right there. 12 threads at 4462. Just to show that Houdini 2.0 does not crash with the proper settings. Now, you know, I'm not going to let this run five days. It's, I'm going to turn this off, take it back in, and post it. Just got home from work, just wanted to let this run. I started it yesterday and uh, just showing that an overclocked 12 threads with the proper settings will run these chess programs. 12 threads at 100% with hyperthreading off running Houdini 2.0 does not crash or blue screen of death or any of the numerous errors have I got them before uh, yes but not on Houdini 2.0 I've had several overclock settings and I'm not having any trouble out of my Houdini now the Intel burn test I had some trouble out of that But the uh, task manager shows this 12 threads at 100%. So 44.62, 12 threads. And there's the clock still running with no crash. 1341 minutes. And I'm going to stop this program. And just for the SR2 guys, I'm going to take my camera off the tripod and show my CPO temp. I can find it looking through the monitor. <laughs> there it is. I get it. Fifty eight degrees.
59 degrees. Let's run for a day at 44.60. We'll set this camera back on the tripod. Let's run for a day at 44.60. 58 degrees Celsius. Okay, I'm going to stop that. So 1343 at 4183. At 46188. Okay, notes a second. What is that? That's million, billion, trillion. Maybe, am I saying that right? 739 million, 722 billion. So it's 3,722 billion. But, it didn't make much of this position though. Okay, I'm going to turn it off. I just wanted to show that Houdini does not crash on my system. I'm not having any crashes with Houdini. I probably run a little bit higher voltage than most guys with EVGA SR2. I found out that, uh, that, that, that the processors, the two processors I have to be stable, uh, They've got to have the voltage. I'll pull this up. EVGA Elite Tuning Utility. Okay, so. There's that. 44, 62, at autofocus. 44, 62, see what the voltage is, 1.482. So a little bit below one and a half volts. So six core. Per socket, two sockets. You see, I think I turned my memory down just a little bit. Let me look at that. Uh, I'd be 1940. No, it's not too bad. It's 1940. And the RAM is 2000. So I'm pretty close. Oh, it is on 210. I didn't know if I had it turned down to 28. And the timing's 910, 924. Okay. 1.482. Core voltage. 4462.